And now, it's time for another Dice Tower Review with Tom Vassell. taking a look at expansion number one for Word on the Street. Expansion number one has more cards for Word on the Street. <laughs> that's really, that's really all it is. Okay, it also comes with an extra timer in case something happened with one of your timers. So I thought I would just, I would show you a few of the categories that came with it. And while we're at it, we'll take a re-look at Word on the Street, which I think is one of the greatest party games of all time. And the party case version of it. The party case version of Word on the Street is kind of like a box inside of a case which you can unzip and open and take out the board and you see a spot for the cards although there really isn't a spot to put the expansion cards although I suppose you could replace them into the spot. You could take out the original and slide in. Now expansion ready. And then the spot for the letters here and now we can play the game. Word on the Street has a pretty cool board, looks like a street, and down the middle of it are these really nice backlight tiles which have, that look like different street signs. And it's not every letter, there's no vowels and there's no stupid letters, uh, or letters that no one ever uses, like Z, X, you know, that sort of thing. Now what will happen in this game is, on a timer, uh, you will have, basically you will get a card green or blue. So if, say for example someone asked me this one, something on which people bet or gamble. And I would say horses. And so I would bring over an H and there's no R, O, then I'd bring over an R and then an S and there's no E and then I'd bring over the S again because there was two S's. If I can bring over S one more time then I will get, then I will win the S. Meanwhile the other team says something cheesy and they say, oh, lasagna, because they want that S back. So they have L-A-S-A-N-A, -A -A, which wasn't really a good word to use, because the more things you can use, the better it is. Um, now let's see, uh, a Disney film. I say, all oh, right, Pocahontas. And then everyone challenges me, can you even spell that? I say, I hope so. So I say P-O-C, Pocahon, H-O-N, Hontas, T-A-S. Is there two S's? Or is there two N's? I don't know. And But you can see that I have the H and the S really close. And so this will go back and forth, something elderly people use. And I like the new font that they use. If you look at the original cards, it has this kind of boring font. And this is like, party font. Also, I like how expansion wants a street sign. Okay, that's, that's minor. Once you get a letter off the board, it's yours, and they can't bring it back anymore. And the first person to get eight over to their side is the winner. And you can play with not just one person, but you can play with teams, and so you're all working together trying to think of a word. But we have these timers to make sure you don't take forever to think of that most perfect word. Or phrase or a different thing, because the questions may have something that's not necessarily... This isn't like Scrabble, where you can't use... Uh, proper nouns. That's why that Disney film, you know, that that could be pretty handy. Now you have to, you have to come to some sort of consensus when you're playing as to how much you are allowed to do. I mean, if the if you're doing Pirates of the Caribbean, I mean, how far can you do that? The compound words, you have to work together to kind of figure out how that works, and your other team can challenge you. But other than that, the the game is very simple and easy to play. So if you like Word on the Street, buy the expansion. If you've never played Word on the Street, buy it. Thanks so much for watching the Dice Tower videos. Find more great videos and reviews, as well as our top-rated audio podcast at Dicetower.com. You can also find the latest board game news at Dicetowernews.com. I'm Eric Summerer, and you've been watching the Dice Tower. The Dice Tower is sponsored by Fun Again Games, the world's best game source. Fun Again Games has over 5,000 games. Shut the door! That's right. Shut it. Yeah. Yeah.